question was posted on my blog asking how this slope sawer would go uh, without ailerons so I thought I'd better test it out. Now without ailerons you need dihedral in the wing otherwise you won't be able to turn. So I took out the straight spar and inserted uh, one that gave a little bit of dihedral. It uh, lifted one wing tip up uh, 120 millimetres and I also uh, locked off the ailerons so now it's just a, a rudder and elevator slope sawer so let's see how it goes at this point I noticed that the rudder wasn't very effective at all I had to use full left and right stick to make the turns but it was still gliding okay um, showed possibilities but I think it just needs a bigger rudder to be able to uh, have more authority in the turns the gulls were certainly interested in it so uh, Let's just fly around a bit playing with the seagulls. That was a little bit of a tip stall there when I tried to do the uh, inward turn, but this plane recovers very quickly from stalls. This was a solid 15 knots northeasterly, really nice wind. The dihedral made it very smooth and stable, uh, but you give up a fair bit of aerobatic performance. It could do loops without problems, but I couldn't do rolls without the ailerons. So with a bigger rudder control surface and maybe a little bit more dihedral, this would work as a rudder elevator slope sawer.